wear this hair any how you want it and you I guys. did the zigzag method and you guys this hair is like bomb like bomb hey everyone and welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be showing you how i installed and styled these braids that i'm wearing these hair are from toya Trust. this is their 22 inch passion braids hair this is one of their newly released braids and i'm loving it they are so bomb side of the pack it came with eight packs and i use all of the strands to do this install right here i did the zigzag method and you guys this hair is like bomb like bomb like and it's 22 inches long so you guys you know I'm loving it I'll leave all the information in my description bar down below so if you are interested to see how I install and style these hair well keep on watching don't forget to subscribe to my channel give this video a big thumbs up and to comment down in the comment section bar down below so let's jump right into this install so the hair that I'm going to be installing today is from Toya Trust on Amazon. They sent me over their 22 inch newly released passion braids hair. Inside of the big bag there is 8 smaller bags with 16 strands in each bag. Makes it equivalent to 128 pre-lubed strands. So inside of the bag as well I received another crochet hook and some hair decors. So let's jump right into this hair install so inside of the passion braids bag I received a card toya trust I got a crochet hook another crochet hook and some hair decors and the passion braids I received two four six eight so there are eight packs of the passion twist braids inside so on each loop there is 16 pre-looped passion twist braids and it's in the inch 22 inches so what i'm going to be using for this install is my murray's australian beeswax rat tail comb my big tea comb my crochet hook and you need some hair bands and you need and some hair clips to like pin up the section but what I'm gonna do I'm going to be doing the braiding pattern for my hair in zigzag so I'm starting out by sectioning out my hair into two sections to the front and to the back so right now I'm just working on the front section so I am parting the hair in the way I want it to go to begin the individual zigzag braids so I'm just going to section out my hair and begin the braiding process so I'm just parting out my hair and then after that I am going in with my australian murray's beeswax to begin the braiding process so again i'm just going to do individual braids and i'm just going to join the braids to create one elongated braids to the front so i'm just working on that as you can see i finished most of the section to the front again i'm going to part my hair in individual braids and join the braids together to the front portion so I'm just working on that until the front section is completed and then I'm going to begin the braiding pattern to the back So the braiding pattern that I'm going to be using to the back is I'm going to be doing individuals as well. I'm just parting my hair and then I'm going to part my hair in some triangle parts in the back. It doesn't have to be super neat or anything. It's just my preference. So I'm just going to work on that. And what I'm going to do, the braids to the back portion, I'm going to be joining them to the second row that I'm going to be doing. And I'm going to do that until I am completed in the back 
portion so now i'm completed i'm joining the front braids to the back braids in one elongated braid so i'm joining all the individual hair together in the middle portion so i can get that realistic effect so when i begin to crochet the braids onto my hair it would look as individual braids so again i'm just joining everything together in the middle portion and after I finish braiding everything together, I'm going in with my crochet hook and I'm just going to crochet the remaining of my hair together so it can be the way I want it to be when I begin to crochet the hair onto my head. So as you guys can see, I finished three rows of the Passion Braids hair already. And as you can see, it looks pretty realistic. So what I'm doing, I'm pushing the crochet needle through pulling through the hair and I'm just going to loop that around one time it's your preference if you want to loop it around two time for extra security but because I'm not going to be keeping these crochet braids in for a very long time I'm just looping it in one time and as you can see in the middle portion the hair mimics like individual braids which was the effect I wanted to do it's a versatile braiding pattern so you can do half up half down you can put your hair in a bun anyhow you want it so i'm just going to continue to crochet the middle portion until i am satisfied and then i'm going to work my way up to the front portion So I'm just going to continue to fill up the middle portion of my hair with the crochet braids and then I'm going to work on the front portion. So I'm just pushing the crochet hook through, I'm pulling the hair through it, closing the latch hook and I'm going to just wrap that around one time. And if you want, you can wrap it around two times for extra security. And I'm going to just continue to fill up my hair until everything is completed. And again, I used all of the eight packs of the braids from Toya Tress. This is their Passion Braids hair in 22 inches. And so far, I am loving how the hair came out. And it looks pretty realistic. So it's your preference if you want to try out this braiding pattern for yourself. So you can see what I'm talking about. So this is the end result. You guys, I hope you enjoyed it. So you guys, this is the end result of my Passion Braids install. These hair are from Toya Tress. Again, this is their 22 inch newly released passion braid it's super long it's past my breast area so it's pretty pretty long and the way how i install these braids is pretty versatile so you can put your hair up in a bun you can put it in a half up half down so it's pretty versatile so you can try out this braiding pattern and to lay my baby hair as usual i used my gorilla snot gel so that was it and this is the end result and i'm loving these braids so thank you so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this install video so until next time always remember to put god first in everything that you do and see you in my next video god bless